this is also very interesting. This is from the History Channel. Uh, let's uh, go back and give you a more fuller spin of this. Okay, right here. Now, these are some of the so-called Antichrist figures, the figures from World War II. And we know of this, this one right here. This is Mussolini. Notice, they show us the evil powers from World War II, but they suppress. See, the mystery of God and Christ is still being suppressed concerning His majesty. But clearly, these other, these other evildoers, or these ones who are considered to be these Antichrist-type figures, are, com are, are continually demonstrated over and over. Now, this is from the 9-11, September 11th, Ethiopia's New Year's, and you all recall what occurred at that particular, that particular time. This is the Nostradamus, the lost, so-called lost books of Nostradamus that have been said to have been found after, what, 500 years? After 500 years, which is close to the approximation of the time that the lost sheep have been the lost sheep as well. Now, the link and connection of this document with its true origins, its Ethiopic origins, whether this is a counterfeit or the real thing, the elements that this particular document speaks about, we have correspondences in our own Ethiopic files. Now, notice this is found in Italy, in, in the Rome's the, the Catholic secret archives. And remember Mussolini? That was pictured a little bit earlier. And we know about the obelisk and the stone lion and the other art and facts that were stolen. The manuscripts and other manuscript documents that were stolen. It's interesting that after all this time that they would find this lost book. But what's really lost or hidden is the real origin of the knowledge or the information in this particular so-called um, lost book right here, the lost book of uh, Nostradamus. So this documentary video is one that we uh, recommend that ones check out if they haven't checked it out before, but check it out from a, a Ethiopic perspective or through Ethiopian uh, spectacles as as it were, because there's much that we can, there's a half of the story that's, that's hidden and embedded in a lot of this information right here. So we just wanted to point that out from our previous, uh, our previous uh, vid on Caduce Georgis on St. George, the serpent, the serpent bearer. Some believe that the manuscripts remaining seven images alone show just cause for the book's suppression that they expand on the mysterious one male text and spell out with alarming precision when and how mankind's worst nightmare 